Hello everyone, how are you doing today? Uh, today's video we have a new laptop. This one is a Huawei laptop and this one comes with an AMD Ryzen 5. Uh, one of the really nice features about this laptop I saw that I loved and I wish the rest of the companies they would implement this one into their laptop is the webcam. The webcam on this one is not visible and it took me a little while to find out that is between F6 and F7. This button right here, you press it down, the camera just comes up in 45 degree angle. This is a really nice feature that they have in here. In this laptop, I'm going to show you guys uh, how to open it up and if you can upgrade the RAM or you cannot upgrade the RAM because many of you guys keep asking me, uh, why don't you open it up and show us if you can upgrade the RAM or you cannot upgrade the RAM. So that's what I'm going to do today. To open it up, you will need an opening tool. For the opening tool, my camera is not focusing, I don't know. For the opening tool, you need an iFixit tool set or any screwdriver set, but I would recommend you guys to grab this iFixit set. They come with all the bits that you need. You're going to be using torque number five. And after this one, you will need an opening tool. This set comes with an extensive set that gives you all the pliers and the opening tools if you want to get that one or you can just get the screwdriver set. At least if you get the screwdriver set I would recommend you guys. The link is in my description. But for the opening tool you can simply get a guitar pick. These are really nice guitar picks. The metallic ones and they're perfectly suitable to opening electronics. So number one. We're going to remove all the screws at the bottom cover of the laptop. The same method that has the MacBook. So go ahead and remove all the screws. The screws at the bottom cover, they have all the same size and height. So don't worry about mismatching them. As it doesn't make any difference if you put the screws in the wrong place here. All right, once you have it in this position, what you want to do, you want to grab the guitar pick, start one of the from the hinge at the back right here, and you want to stick it right between the top and the bottom cover. Just a little bit of force or wiggle it around, you should get it in there, just like that. Now, what you want to do, you want to just twist it upward. Oh, mine came loose. Let me see if I can do it from here. I can try it from the back here a little bit. Um, once you get this, the corner loose up, you can start going from to the side. You want to just twist it. You want to hit that click. Go to the front end, same thing. Twist, twist, and everything should come out. Okay, now you can put it down and just lift up the cover. All right, down here, let's see if we can find the ramps. Unfortunately, the RAMs are not upgradable on these models. The RAMs come built in on the board, so the RAMs are somewhere over this or soldered on the board under the NVMe drive. So the RAM dims are not available on this model. That's just uh, something you have to deal with because there is not enough space on the bottom side to put a jack for the RAM dim nor on the top portion there is enough space to put the, another RAM dim. So if your model comes with an 8 gig of RAM, that's what you get. You cannot upgrade or do anything to it. The only upgrade you can do is to upgrade your SSD NVMe drive. And that's it. That's, that's all you can do on these models. You can probably change the Wi-Fi to a different model, Wi-Fi module. And the processor is soldered on the board. You cannot do nothing about it. And that's it pretty much. All right, so then we know that there is actually you cannot upgrade the RAM. Next step is to put it back together. Grab the bottom cover, bring it over, place it on top, and squeeze the corners. Make sure you hit those clicks. Press it really hard. Now, what you want to do, you want to open it up in 45 degree angle. And you want to just pinch the top and the bottom cover so this extra gap goes underneath. So just press it. 
just like that. Really, lots of force you need. And but you have to have this kind of even, nice, soft gap right there. Any opening, just pinch them. And the last thing would be to put the bottom screws. I hope this video answered your questions that you've been asking. At first hand, now you guys saw it by yourself. There's no way that you can place a memory RAM DIMM on these laptops. I hope this guide helps you out. If it did, please click that thumbs up button. And if you guys subscribe, it really helps and motivates me to take more requests and answer your comments. Again, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video.